Imagine stepping into a realm where blades of grass become towering forests, where a dewdrop sparkles like a crystal chandelier, and where the smallest log hides a bustling city of tiny architects. Welcome to the world of the Secret Bug Explorers, a place of endless wonder that exists just beyond the toe of your shoe. This is not a distant jungle or a deep ocean trench. It is the hidden micro-wilderness of your own backyard, local park, or even a forgotten corner of a windowsill. Here, every day is an epic adventure filled with jewel-colored beetles. The cockroach is a creature that evokes a powerful and almost universal yuck. But it's also one of the most fascinating and successful organisms on the planet. Here's a breakdown of its face from the visceral reaction to the incredible biology. They thrive in dirty, damp, and dark places like sewers, drains, and garbage. This association with unsanitary conditions Harlequin bug is a serious garden pest, especially to cabbage, kale, and mustard plants. It's basically the fashionista of the bug world, and also the most destructive. Harlequin bug doesn't run, it releases a stinky chemical to scare predators away. Harlequin comes from a colorful jester, or clown, from old European theater. Its eggs are black and white, like a warning sign saying, It's basically the fashionista of the bug world. Honeybees live in colonies with a complex social structure including a queen, worker bees, and drones. Honeybees perform a dance to communicate the location of flowers, water, or new nest sites. Honeybees are responsible for pollinating around one-third of the food we eat, including fruits, vegetables, and nuts. The buzzing comes from the rapid beating of their wings about 200 times per second. Red palm weevil is a major insect pest that destroys palm trees from the inside out. It causes severe damage without any early visible signs of infection. Red palm weevil larvae tunnel deep into the tree trunk and feed on soft tissues. This feeding weakens the tree, often leading to its death. Red palm weevil is a serious economic threat to coconut and date palm industries. Mantises are ambush predators. They wait patiently and then attack with lightning speed. Their front legs are lined with sharp spikes to grab and hold prey securely. Mantises are the only insects that can turn their heads side to side about 150 degrees. This helps them track moving prey and stay alert for danger. Leafcutter ants. Mantises are ambush predators. They wait patiently and then attack with lightning speed. Rhinoceros beetles are a group of large, herbivorous insects belonging to the subfamily Dynastinae. They are named for the distinctive horns on the males, which they use to fight other males for mates and territory, much like their mammalian namesakes. Herbivores, larvae eat decaying wood and plant matter, while adults feed on sap, fruit, and nectar. Rhinoceros beetles are a group of large, herbivorous insects belonging to the subfamily Dynastinae. Dragonflies are living fossils. 
They existed long before the dinosaurs, with fossil records dating back over 300 million years. The prehistoric ancestors of today's dragonflies, like Meganeura, had wingspans of up to 2.5 feet, 75 centimeters. They can hover in place for up to a minute, fly backwards, and change direction instantly. Butterflies cannot chew solid food. They have a long, straw-like proboscis that acts as their tongue. It stays coiled up under their head until they find a liquid meal like nectar, rotting fruit, or tree sap. Scorpions glow blue-green under ultraviolet UV, light due to chemicals in their exoskeleton. Scorpions give birth to live young, unlike many other arachnids. Newborn scorpions ride on their mother's back until their first molt. Scorpion venom is being studied for cancer treatments, pain relief, and brain tumor detection. Spiders play a crucial role in controlling insect populations, making them important for ecological balance. Spiders inject digestive enzymes into their prey and suck up the liquefied insides. Most spiders are solitary and predatory, feeding mainly on insects. Spiders produce different types of silk for different purposes. Webs, egg sacs, wrapping prey, etc. Spiders play a crucial role in controlling insect populations A snail's shell is made of calcium carbonate and grows with the snail. They cannot leave their shell. Snails have a muscular foot that they use to glide slowly, producing mucus to reduce friction. Snails can hibernate or estivate, summer hibernation, to survive extreme conditions by sealing their shell with a layer of mucus. Stag beetles are named for their large, antler-like jaws that resemble the antlers of a stag, male deer. Stag beetles usually live only a few months, mainly in the summer to mate and lay eggs. Stag beetles are important decomposers, helping recycle nutrients by breaking down decaying wood. Adult stag beetles usually live only a few months, mainly in the summer to mate and lay eggs. Stag beetles are named for their large, antler-like jaws that resemble the antlers of a stag, male deer. Stag beetles are important decomposers. Palm tree assassin. This insect is one of the most destructive pests for palm trees. It's native to South Asia, but has spread to Africa, Europe, the Middle East, and the Americas, primarily through the trade of infested trees. The female weevil lays up to 300 eggs in small holes. It chews at the base of the palm's leaves, or in wounds on the tree's trunk. Palm tree assassin. Grasshoppers can jump up to 20 times their body length thanks to their strong hind legs. Grasshoppers make sounds, called stridulation, 
by rubbing their hind legs against their wings to attract females. Grasshoppers look like small, wingless adults and molt several times as they grow. Grasshoppers live in grasslands, forests, deserts, and even urban areas. Grasshoppers can jump up to 20 times their body length Snakes are reptiles. They belong to the order Squamata and are closely related to lizards. Snakes can consume prey much larger than their heads because their jaws are connected by very stretchy ligaments. Snakes live in forests, deserts, oceans, like sea snakes, and even urban areas. The blue iguana is an ancient species, endemic only to the island of Grand Cayman. It is a descendant of iguanas that likely rafted to the island from the mainland millions of years ago and has evolved in isolation ever since. Their stunning blue coloration is not just for camouflage. The bold blue, turquoise and grey hues are most vibrant during the breeding. Red iguanas look like mini-dinosaurs, with spiny crests running down their backs and long, powerful tails. Red iguanas may show more green or orange hues as they age, or during breeding season. Red iguanas are a color morph of the green iguana. Iguana, iguana. The male Jackson's chameleon, Trioceros jacksoni, is one of the most distinctive and prehistoric looking reptiles in the pet trade and in the wild. Instantly recognizable, he looks like a miniature triceratops that has mastered the art of camouflage. The male Jackson's chameleon is defined by the three prominent horns on his face, which are made of keratin, the same material as our fingernails. The male Jackson's chameleon, Trioceros jacksoni, instantly recognizable, delicate lace-winged flies, and ants marching in perfect, purposeful formation. To become an explorer, you need no special passport, just a sense of curiosity, a gentle hand, and the willingness to look closer at the world beneath your feet. Embarking on this secret exploration reveals a universe of astonishing complexity and beauty. 